Hey YouTube, Stack Attack here with a weekly penny hunt. We got another one of these boxes with no, no holes in it. So hopefully there's some old coins in here and uh, we're gonna be opening the rolls and looking for old coins inside. So let's get into it. Oh, this thing is tight. How do you even do that? Oh. All right, let's see a Canadian ender. There we go. I don't see any wheat penny enders, but uh, that is okay. It's not all new. We'll get into this box, see what we can find. And as soon as we find something old and interesting, we'll let you know. Stay tuned. All right. I don't want you. We got a Canadian and a wheat penny in this roll. This is the first roll of the box. We got a 1956 D. Take that. Nice find on the board. And let's just check this roll out. This was the first roll I was looking at. I didn't see any wheat pennies, but yeah, nothing there. So we'll keep on going. We're on. All right, we got a shiny wheat penny here. Haven't seen the uh, date. 1945D. Check this out. I have an older one to be this shiny. So happy to have that. That's pretty cool. What? Yeah, check it out. All right, keep on looking. All right, we have another wheat penny. It's kind of worn. Hopefully it'll be older. 1945. All right. Take the last one we found over this one, but happy to have them both. Hopefully we can find some older coins today. All right, next roll and. Got a wheat penny right there. I think you mean a chicken. 1925. What? Yeah, look at the back of this. Look at the. Okay. There, we'll, we'll check out what else is in here what as this the? is being inspected. That's pretty nice on the reverse. I thought it was yeah. going to be from the 40s or yeah. something. Yeah, I thought I it was. See a lot of uh, the wheat here. 1925. That is awesome. Mm -hmm. Awesome, very nice coin. Let's see what, uh, see if there's anything else in the roll. Let's just a nice 1975. All right, nothing else. We we'll take it though. All right, three rolls in a row. I've got a wee penny in. I thought it was fuller, but whatever. <laughs> 1956 D. Alright, this one. Pretty worn for 56, but we'll take it. Happy to have it. Alright, so we're going to zoom out a little bit. Not quite halfway through the box, but you just got a, another roll with a Canadian and a wheat penny. That's Both your wheat penny finds have come with a Canadian. 1950, 1957D. All right, we'll take it. All right. No, do the I'm gonna shiny do the shiny first. one first. Look at that. I don't know what's going on there. It looks like it's got a lot of scratches, but it's also in nice condition. Nice kind details. of nice condition. 1958D. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's like somebody scratched it clean or something. <clears throat> you already seen this one? Yeah. 1937, nice find. Now we've got coins from the 50s, 40s, 30s, and 20s. Awesome find. You think so? Yeah, I think that's going to be a good one. It does look kind of worn. 1940, not what? that good. I mean, it's good. It's a wee penny. Yeah. But yeah, I thought it might be a little older. Yeah, I thought it'd be at least one year to hold that. We'll take it. Goodness, you got another double wheat penny roll with a Canadian, and you're not even done looking through it. What is you've seen the dates? I'm one of them. I have. 1945. That's the one I seen the date on. All right, clean. That one's probably 40, 40s. 52D. Mm -hmm. yeah. Nice. Yeah. Looks like Abraham Lincoln sneezing there. Is that junk? <laughs> uh, <laughs> All 
right, we got a wee penny. Yes, there's two left. Just don't see it. 1946. No mint marks, so that's gonna be another Philly coin. Take it, and uh, we'll see. So this was the roll that was in front of me when we were just looking at those uh, last two wheat pennies. So we got um, one there, we've got you know another 15, 16 we wheat pennies to go. Canadian. You got another Canadian. All right. Keep on going. All right, just got another wheat penny. And here's another old Canadian. 1956. 1963. Take it. And you got a 1963 Canadian. Why do you have to show oh, 53. it? 53. 53? Oh, yeah. Let's see if we got anything else in here. Oops. Nothing. Let's see. Nope, nothing else. All right, we'll keep on going. All right, next roll. And we got a wheat penny. Another 1956D. All right, take it. Let's see uh, if there's anything else in here. So far, a lot of Not a single <laughs> newer uh, pennies in here. All right, that's it for that roll. All right, we got another one. Is this, is this a 1909? No. 1958, indeed. It's as new as it gets. We'll take it. Penny Ender, looks like a 44. Well, I think it's a 44. I think so, too. You're right. Let's see. What if I 44D. Awesome. So, let's see if this roll has any, any other good coins in it. Check it out. Some possible brown coins that... Could be old. Nope, not that one. Nope. All right, that was it. Well, we got an ender. All right, that is the hunt. We ended up with uh, 16 wheat pennies in total. We got uh, eight from the 50s. We have six from the 40s, and then our two older finds today were this 1937 and this 1925 both from uh, Philly. So, pretty cool to get some oldies. Definitely take them. The 25 looks better than the 37. Both, both pretty decent looking coins. So, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you're having good luck in your hunts, and we will see you next time. Take care.